Hello and welcome to my channel, Kui Kwame from Ghana. And what are we doing today? Today we are looking at day and day names in tree. Days and day names in tree. There are many people who visit Ghana and they struggle with the basic days and day names. And it's an interesting topic among uh, our brothers and sisters in the diaspora because it is one of the commonest things that you be identified with. People would like to know the day on which you were born and the name that you bear. I will stick to the basics, what you need in, in case you find yourself in Ghana or anywhere around West Africa where these names are very popular. They are important because in the olden days, by meeting someone, you get asked on what day were you born? Or by the person mentioning his name, you get to know the day on which he was born. We can develop further to even know the appellations that we give to each of the days and the names they bear. But that will be for another lesson. So let's just dive straight into it. So on the Akan traditional calendar, the day begins with Sunday and then it, it falls now to Saturday. So we are just going to go according to that. So day number one definitely will be Sunday. And in Sunday in Ghana on most greater West Africa, we call it in the tree language. And let me state this before I continue that we have different variations of tree in Ghana. You have the Ashanti, you have the Fante, you have the Achim, you have the Bono and other variations. But I will stick to the basic like Equapem, which is very easy to teach and easy to speak. Ashanti and then maybe Akim variations. I don't want to complicate it by introducing so many, you know, variations that will confuse you. So I will stick to these three or four because they are very related. The differences may be in the maybe one letter or how it is pronounced. So let's start. For example, Sunday. When someone is born on Sunday, Sunday in the tree, either in the Kwapim, Akim or Ashanti is Kwesida. And Kwesida is very popular among the Kwapims. And then Kwesiada is, I believe, between the Akim, how they pronounce it, and then the Ashanti is too. They say Kwesiada, Kwesiada. And the Equapims would just say Quesida, Quesida. And a girl who is born on Quesida is called Akusia. Akusia. And this cuts across. I think it's, in, it's only in Fante that people call girl, a girl born on Sunday easy. But in Greater Akan, a girl born on Sunday is called Akusia. And a boy will be called Quesi or Quesi. You can see that. In one of the spellings, we use K-W-A and one we use K-W-E. Okay, it's the same thing, Kwesi or Kwesi. A girl born on a Sunday is Akosia and a boy born on Sunday is called Kwesi. Let's move to Monday. Monday in a country is Joda. You may hear Juada, Joda or Juada and it is the same thing. So a girl born on a Juada or a Monday will be called Ajua. Ajua. And this one cuts across all the uh, different variations of the same dialect. A boy born on Monday, which is Juada, is Kweju or Kweju. Either it is spelled W K W A or K W E. And it is the same thing. Kweju or Kweju. Joe. Number three is Tuesday. Tuesday is pronounced in tree as binada. Binada. You may hear a binada and it is the same thing. So a girl born on a Tuesday will be called Abina. And the boy will be called Kwabina. Kwabina. Sometimes you hear people pronounce it as Kwamina. Like K W A M E N A, Kwamina, but it is the same thing, Kwabina or Kwamina. Now let's move to number four, which is Wednesday. Wednesday is Wukwada or Wukuda. Wukuda 
Owukwada. And a girl born on Wednesday, Owukwada, is Ikuya. Ikuya. And some may say Ekua. And some may begin with E, which is Ikua. And it is the same thing. The boy is Kweku. Or Kweku. Kweku or Kweku. Number five is Thursday. Thursday. So Thursday in tree is Yawda or Yawada. You may hear these two variations depending on where the person is coming from or which variation of the language he is he or she is speaking. Yawda or Yawada. And a girl born on a Thursday is called Ya. And the boy will be called Yao. And this cuts across. Ya for a girl and Yao for a boy. Number six is Friday. Friday. Among the greater Equa family, you hear Fida. Fida. And I think among the Akim and the Shanti, you may hear Fiada or Ifiada. And it's the same thing. So a girl born on Friday will be called Ifwa. Ifwa. Some may begin with E, which is A. And some, many of them or most people begin with Ifwa. And then the boy will be called Kofi. Kofi. So Ifwa and Kofi also cuts across. It's the same across the tree-speaking people. Then the last one is Saturday. Saturday. And in tree, they will say Mimineda. Mimineda. And a, a girl will be called Ama. And the boy will be called Kwame. So you hear the popular uh, Saturday names in Ghana. One will be Kwame Nkroma. A Saturday born. The Nkroma has a different meaning. That will be for another lesson. So basically, these are the days and the day names that is used in greater as Akan speaking, tree speaking, you know, tribes in Ghana. Don't forget the Akan tribe is an umbrella where there are variations of the same language under that umbrella. But these names and days are just similar in terms of pronunciation, their meaning, and then the etymology, the history behind it is the same. So once again, this is your brother Ki Kwame. Until I come your way. Once again, with another interesting lesson, stay tuned, subscribe, and like the page. See you again. Bye-bye.